Hi everyone, this is Andrew Tai and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be talking about the first day that I got my Apple Silicon M1 MacBook Air and what happened when I tried to erase it. So like many people, um, maybe I'm in a minority, but there's enough of a minority that probably thousands of people did this, um, is that uh, I managed to erase my hard drive um, when I first received my Mac. And the reason I did this was because um, I decided to do a migration from my MacBook Pro on the, with the Intel chip. And I, I did it peer to peer and it told me it was gonna take about 12 hours. And so I decided to, to quit in the middle of the migration. And from my experience, um, the, the cleanest way to quit is simply to um, go to disk utility in recovery mode and then erase the hard drive and then reinstall the operating system. And I thought that this would be very, very straightforward. But um, what happens is that you can go through disk utility and then you can wipe the, the drive. And then when you install Big Sur, what happens is that when you get to around um, 50 minutes left, you'll get this error message which says, an error occurred preparing the update. Fail to personalize the software update. Please try again. And um, from what I've read of uh, people's experience with this, um, talking to the Apple customer service, is that there's no solution to this. There's literally no nothing that Apple can it's gotten so bad that this particular person has just simply exchanged their computer and they've considered it kind of bricked and uh, they just want a new one that's working. And um, fortunately, someone has found a solution um, in this thread on Mac Rumors where um, you need to use the revive or restore function using a host Mac. So another Mac or MacBook that uses a USB-C port. So it's um, any of the kind of more modern uh, Max from the last few years, and um, you set a revival restore process after putting the um, the problem Apple Silicon computer into DFU mode. And um, I've got my own video on how to set a computer into DFU mode to help you because it's quite a tricky, complicated thing to do. So anyway, um, I just wanted to give a warning to people: don't erase your hard drive um, when you get your Apple Silicon Mac because um, at the time of writing, at the time of recording, there is no um, simple way of fixing the issue. And if I didn't have access to a Mac um, to do the DFU process and the restore and revive, then um, I'd be stuck with a computer that I couldn't use at all. So um, anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like and subscribe. I'm going to leave links to these um, articles in the description. And um, if you found it useful, please uh, check out my next tech video.